Welcome back, Stuart and Stuart Attorneys. I'm Nick Wagner. To my left, the man, the myth, maybe the legend. It sounds like you're talking about Bigfoot. Yeah, yeah, I am. Darren Stewart. Uh, Darren, we get calls from clients, past clients, prospective clients. Uh, any interesting calls lately? Absolutely. Okay. I wrote some down. What you got? Uh, should I hire an attorney if my child is injured on a playground accident Ooh. in Indiana. Ooh, I like that. Yeah. And I got this call and uh, I immediately thought of you. Yeah. Uh, Nick has handled numerous playground cases, bully cases at school. Mm -hmm. Those, he's kind of our, our expert on that, if you will. He um, really knows what he's doing. So I did answer their questions, but for the purposes of the video, I'm gonna throw this back at you. Yeah. What are your thoughts? Yeah, well, there's a lot of moving parts uh, that go behind the answer to that question. And I'll tell you, this day and age with bullying and all that being as prevalent as it is uh, across social media and the school's involvement. I mean, a lot of schools flat out ignore it, uh, which is really sad. Um, but, you know, we're here to, to be your voice, to fight for you and your child. Because uh, schools, we give up a lot of trust with them when we drop our kids off or when the kids get on the bus. We, we are, are really, you know, put it, putting ourselves out there and, and hoping that the schools take care of the children. And, and they're supposed to, they're supposed to be, you know, looking out for their safety and looking out not just, you know, by themselves, but as they interact with other kids, like on a playground. Mm -hmm. And a playground would be what, you know, uh, middle school and, and younger and, and, but with, with high schoolers, it's, it's, it's. They should have proper supervision out yeah. there. That's what, it, you know, we can't just let them go crazy out there. The, you know, another thing that I covered with this caller was the shortened, statute of limitations and we yeah. have to do a tort claim notice yeah so you don't have you have two years to file a lawsuit but if you don't take steps in the first 120 days yeah. and properly notify them you can't file a yeah lawsuit. there's so all there's all kinds of things you have to do right off the bat if you think that you have a claim against a school and uh the best thing you can do and to answer that question what i would say is yes i you should hire an attorney if for no other reason to get our opinion on whether or not you have a case. It's Obviously, we'll want your business, but if it's not us, you should talk to them. Right, right, exactly. So to answer the question, your answer would be yes, hire an attorney? Absolutely. Okay, all right. And if you need help in that regard, Stuart and Stuart Attorneys is, is here to help you out.